and hear the action right here on 97.7, the big station. It's Roger Price with a look at sports. The second round of the high school playoffs get underway tonight. The KICM games tonight feature the Ardmore Tigers in Tulsa to take on Bishop Kelly in the state quarterfinals. Ardmore head coach Josh Newby coming off his first ever playoff victory Nose number two won't be so easy. Well, I know that they're very well coached. I, I, some of our guys on our staff know their their, their coaching staff. I, I don't, but they've said that the, they're, they're going to be coached very well. We know they're going to be a bunch of smart kids. And, uh, you know, they run some too tight schemes. It's, a, it's just an old-fashioned, you know, type, type offense. So we're going to have to, you know, win in the trenches one of those games. You know, we're going to have to go on the road and be tough and win in the trenches somehow. And, uh, you know, it's, it's going to be a heck of a game. I'm excited for our kids in this opportunity. Phil Summers and Billy Bean will bring you the broadcast tonight. You can watch it live on the Tiger Channel at KICM.com or hear the action 7 p.m. pregame, 7.30 kickoff on 97.7 The Big Station. And in Davis tonight, the Wolves tackle Christian Heritage at 7.30 in round two of the 2A playoffs. Davis coach Jody Weber knows his Wolves have to be ready to go tonight. Uh, they can do a lot of things, and it's such a contrast this week. Uh, more so than any team we play all year, they they, they throw it. And, uh, um, you know, everybody throws it now um, to some extent, except us, but um, they want to throw the ball. They're not trying to be 50-50. They're not trying to fool you that they're trying to be balanced. They're going to throw it, and they're going to run it just enough to keep you honest if you're just going to totally abandon the inside. But, um, you know, I think Coach Parker has a good plan, so we'll see if we can execute it. You can watch that game as well on the Wolves channel at KICM.com. Other playoff teams in the area in action tonight include a few 3A schools. Plainview hosting Douglas. Sulphur is at Jones. Paul's Valley is at Kingfisher. And in 1A, Winniewood is at Watonga. Former Lone Grove running back Jeremy Lewis has left the Tennessee Volunteers for undisclosed reasons. Lewis, who rushed for over 3,000 yards last year for the Longhorns, had appeared in two games for Tennessee is the third volunteer to leave the program this season. No word on his future plans. Local high school basketball on the docket tonight. Elmore City is at Paoli, Thackerville at Mill Creek, and Bray Doyle hosts Temple. In the NBA, the Oklahoma City Thunder look to make it two in a row as they host Brooklyn tonight in the city. College football on Saturday features Oklahoma Sooners in prime time at West Virginia. And a very important Big 12 battle. That game's scheduled to kick just after 7. Number 11, Oklahoma State, is at TCU at 11. And in the NFL on Sunday, the 8-1 Dallas Cowboys will host the Baltimore Ravens' noon kickoff at AT AT&T Stadium. And that's sports brought to you by Glenn Raby Motors. I'm Roger Price, 97.7 The Big Station.